The brilliance of these is there will be no error with line cooks or lack of staff. Hi, Corporate Chef Dana Johnson of Ginsburg's Foods. I would like to share with you Hormel's Fire Braised Chicken Breasts. Here at Ginsburg's, we stock the four ounce breasts. These chicken breasts are fully cooked, minimally processed with no artificial flavors, stored in their own juices. We're gonna do a few different things for you today. All right, let's get started. Open up this package, it's vacuum sealed. Nice and easy to cut open. This is about the breast size. Like again, this is the four ounce portion controlled, so you're not losing anything. There's no extra waste. So you could just throw this into a hotel pan like this, throw it in the oven, get it warm. I'm gonna take this aside and we're gonna make a couple dishes together. We're gonna use the Hormel braised chicken to make some tacos. What I did is take the Hormel chicken breast, shred it up with my hands, add a little bit of taco seasoning, and we're just gonna go ahead and build some tacos here. The nice part about this Hormel meat is, uh, even though I've reheated it, it's super moist. And then the toppings of your choice. We're gonna go with a little fresh cucumber, a little avocado on each one. I don't know, this thing looks pretty good. Mm-hmm. That's a good taco. All right, today I'm gonna to make for you a kebab using the fire-raised chicken. The nice part about this is often I've been to someone's barbecue and found a piece of raw chicken. There's no worries left when you make it this way. You can be completely creative with kebabs, pick whatever veggies that you like, load them up, and then toss them on the grill. And there we have kebabs. We're gonna make a little pasta dish. I did a quick saute of some asparagus, grape tomatoes, some fresh garlic and olive oil. And then I go ahead and add the pesto, and add in some bow ties, if you could use whatever shape pasta you'd like. And then top it off with the perfectly grilled chicken breast. I prefer using the Hormel fire braised chicken for a pasta dish because it's perfectly cooked each time. I'm gonna use the Hormel fire braised chicken to make some chicken salad. So this is two pieces of the four ounce chicken breast shredded up. And then I quartered up some red grapes. And go ahead and add in some mayonnaise. Mix it all together well here. And in no time, we've got a beautiful, fresh made, not canned chicken salad. Let me take that lettuce, pile that chicken salad on there. And there we have it. I'm gonna use the Hormel Fire Braised Chicken to make a mason jar salad. You can make them before service or serve them in house. I'm gonna start with a little bit of romaine lettuce. Let's go ahead and add some of that chicken. Put it right in there cold, because this is fully cooked. Finish it with some carrots, a bit of cucumber. The great part of these mason jar salads is they're super versatile. You can be creative with what you put in there. Obviously, it gives a beautiful presentation by adding color to it. Again, this Fire Braised Chicken, because it was pre-cooked is going to stay super moist in there. These travel well, they also have a, a good long shelf life if you're doing a catering event. 